So back with another video, this is your boy, Phenomenal A. J. Phoenix. And this is Hogwarts Legacy State of Play March 17th. So, I am late doing this, I know it's already been done, but I wanted to um, react to it for you guys. So, if you're new to the channel, please do a huge favour and subscribe to your boy. And if you enjoyed the episode, smash the hell out of that like button. Are you ready, guys? And I will leave this in the description if you want to watch it yourself. So, here we go. One, two, three, click. <laughs> State of play. how good it's going to be. And it's on for 22 minutes, as far as I know of. Lumos. Okay, in game. Footage work in progress. Okay, no worries. There's the castle on the walls. Looks nice. What do you think you're doing here, humans? Wicked. <laughs> the hell is that? That looks nice. Welcome to Hogwarts Legacy. You're a new student at the famed School of Witchcraft and Wizardry with a unique ability to manipulate powerful ancient magic hidden in the wizarding world. You'll need to uncover what's behind the return of this forgotten magic and who is seeking to harness it to destroy wizard goblins. as you may be the one that decides the fate of the entire wizarding world. And it's amazing graphics of the looks of it. Look because at it. Before you can study magic and begin to solve these mysteries, you must create the witch or oh, wizard that's you want awesome. to be. When you arrive at Hogwarts, you will be sorted into one of the four Hogwarts houses, Gryffindor, Hufflepuff, Ravenclaw, or Slytherin. After you settle into your dormitory, you will meet up with your housemates in the common room. You will then <laughs> need to attend classes, and you do have some catching up to do, as you were starting Hogwarts late as a fifth year. Oh, okay. So you are the new student. You'll begin your studies attending charms, defense against the dark arts, herbology, and potions classes. I'm getting this, defo. Class, please welcome the newest rose in our garden. Shall we begin? Shall we begin? <laughs> <laughs> welcome to year five of charms. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work, but I am confident that we will take hold with a passion and rigor <laughs> requisite of such a challenge. The best way to practice is by dueling. We'll start with you two. Time for a proper Hogwarts welcome. That's pretty cool. You may begin. The hell? Awesome. That's cool. Not bad for a beginner. Potions is one of the most challenging and hazardous subjects taught at this school. Here you'll meet your professors and learn to cast spells, grow magical plants, brew potions, and more. In between classes, you'll be able to explore the castle nice. famous for its secrets enchantments and mysteries That's you'll good. discover dungeons and secret passageways Accio. as well as challenging puzzles Accio. that will require magical skill and a clever mind to solve they've done well on this i'm not gonna lie you may even find yourself in iconic locations you've never been able to explore before 
Come on, stop it! It's the late 1800s, so while the common rooms and classes may be familiar, most of your professors will not be. However, you may recognize a few faces. Oh. Ah, all in good fun. Once Sir Patrick lets me join the Headless Hunt, I'll be right there with them. This offering is sure to win the Headless them over. Oh, don't forget why I'm here, sir. You'll come to know this eclectic group of talented witches and wizards in class and while completing side assignments that are part of a special curriculum, ones designed to help you catch up with the other fifth years at your own speed. Ah, oh, the brooms. Lumos. Lumos. Lightens things up. Opportunities for adventure abound in the area surrounding Hogwarts. The magical abilities you learn to master That's through beautiful. your schoolwork will soon become tested as you unravel a dangerous mystery by working alongside the accomplished and yet enigmatic Professor Fig to try and discover if the rumors of a mounting goblin rebellion hold any weight and if the safety of Hogwarts lies in the balance. <laughs> I have Look at him. opinions differ as to how great a threat he really is. So it's a goblin that's the powerful one, not the bolder one. Ranrock's loyalists are capable of so much more than people realize. The wizarding world of this era is fraught with dangers. Creatures corrupted by a magical force, yeah. powerful goblins, and sinister witches and wizards like all one. willing to fight, even kill, to achieve their own goals. In fact, there's an uneasy alliance between the goblins and dark wizards. You said you could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. Oh, right. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. Yeah, Jack. Who is this child? Do you not telling me? But perhaps you shouldn't involve yourself with that just yet. Yeah. <laughs> Bloody awesome. What the bloody hell? What the hell is that? Is cool. They can do that. Expelliarmus. <laughs> Enemies possess unique defensive and offensive abilities, uh -oh. including blasting curses, stunning spells, enchanted weaponry, and more. While some may attack directly, others might enchant and incapacitate you. Mastery of the Shield Charm allows you to deflect ranged spells and direct weapon strikes. That's cool. I like that. Counter-attack with powerful stunning charms, allowing you to I'm follow up there. with extended spell Death combinations. Death I, like, I love the Arab Park films. Students who become particularly yeah, adept at spellcasting will find <laughs> many ways to exploit their enemy's weakness. Look at the zombies! They nice! Oh, awesome! Okay, okay. Slam with Descendo. Incendio. Roast with Incendio. Devastate your enemies using various finishes. Boing, boing. You can even use the mysterious powerful oh, magic I'll your professors do not understand to at least ding, 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 your ding. strongest <laughs> foes. <laughs> Mixing and matching dozens of spells will let you define your combat style. On your path to become the ultimate duelist. I like it. It's my type of game. <laughs> I'm just smashing them on the floor, Constant. Perhaps you'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces on your own time. Yes, Nutter. In addition to classes and spells, you'll have access to a deep set of upgrades, talents and skills to aid your progression as oh, a wizard. Okay. Complete challenges throughout the world to earn experience. Level up your abilities by choosing talents to upgrade your spells, plants and potions to increase oh, no. their power. Decide which talents best fit your playstyle to allow you to focus on your favorite types of magic. That's cool. You can also loot, buy, or craft your own magical gear. 
that will increase your offensive and defensive capabilities in combat. Also, you can flat things to can be build a and specialized which is to even allow for better. greater abilities for your chosen playstyle. Use a strong, even motion when cutting your ingredients. They've put a lot of work in this game to make it customizable. Spells are not the only tools at your disposal in combat. As you hone your wand skills, you can continue to further your magical education at Hogwarts, progressing your development as a witch or wizard. Brew potions that can increase your power when you need a boost. Cool! Grow and deploy magical plants to mob the battlefield and keep your enemies at bay. Look at them! Bong, bong, bong. I'll just slam them on the floor. I wouldn't even attack them. I'll you just... can even unleash deadly mandrake seedlings to incapacitate oh, unsuspecting enemies. Oh, those stupid enemies. plants that you bring them out. In beasts class, you will learn about a variety of magical beasts you might encounter, oh, both at school both and as you explore then. the world surrounding the castle the and its fantastic grounds. Beast films the goal and... of today is to remind all of oh, you how look to at that. on a broomstick safely. Learning and mastering broom flight is highly recommended so that you may travel around the world more quickly. I want you to do my herbology homework. You're despicable. When does this come out? Some abilities may be taught to you by students who become your friends. As you develop relationships with these schoolmates, they can accompany you on your journey as your companions. Companions! And over time, you'll learn their stories. This is our chance! This, Natsai this Onai game. is a brave adventurer driven by the justice she seeks. Poppy Sweeting has a kind heart and loves magical Aww. beasts, connecting with them more easily than with humans. But what happens now? Unafraid of detention or breaking the rules, Sneaking in the restricted Naughty boy! Is Sebastian Sallow, a charismatic Slytherin, We've been over this boy! Rubblefix cannot reverse a curse! With a troubling family secret. Nothing can. The sooner you accept that reality, the better. You'll meet these students and more as you explore common rooms, hallways between classes, and regular gathering areas. I can't wait areas. for it. Welcome to the Room of Requirement. Requirement. One of the most remarkable secrets of Hogwarts is known as the Room of Requirement. Yeah, this ain't in the films. This is just made up this bit. You're introduced to this space that seems to sense what you need and then provides it for you. Ah, okay. Since you need to catch up to your peers, the room provides space for you to sow and harvest plants, brew potions, and upgrade your gear. But I'm so glad that the mix, the Fantastic Beasts films, as well as Harry Potter films. house elf named Deke helps you discover Vivarians oh, that so allow you Dobby to nurture then. your own menagerie of Dobby. magical beasts. What is it? Deke isn't sure. Only one way to find out. You can freely customize this space to reflect your personality and magical specialties. That's bonkers. <laughs> A little kitty cat. Beyond the castle wall. What the? How big is this? Not everything you need on your journey is available at Hogwarts. You'll want to visit the nearby wizarding village of Hogsmeade, where loads of shops and vendors out. can They've provide you with the well. supplies you require. We buy ones and from potion ingredients and recipes to seeds for magical plants to all sorts of gear. <laughs> but Hogsmeade also has its dangerous side. A band of dark witches and wizards, emboldened by the turmoil of the times, wander the village outskirts. You must avoid them or defeat them. I'll just defeat As the you explore, people. you'll find the world surrounding Hogwarts is alive with activity, wonders, and areas of unusual this interest. This massive game. As the man. school year progresses, dynamic seasons and climates oh, so will fill the, the sky the with lightning or sunshine, the... or coat the ground with snow or rain. Unique wizarding hamlets pepper the countryside, each with vendors and residents who have stories to tell, this is... and missions with which they could use your assistance. Be on the lookout for enchanting magical puzzles that may very well have been designed by Merlin himself when he was a student at Hogwarts. Magical beasts roam the lands outside the castle walls. Some have been corrupted by a mysterious dark magic, while others are at risk of poachers and their Aww. traps. 
If you're feeling benevolent, you can rescue them and restore them to health in the room of requirement. Oh, that's cool. So you can take them but back. But there are dangers beyond your understanding in the world as well. Dungeons and vaults hold perilous threats <laughs> and Look at also that untold rewards. Them away. <laughs> Be careful where you choose to explore, as it may lead you down a darker path. Oh. Master spells. Befriend new allies. Journey across a landscape oh, never seen that. before. Uncover ancient secrets. Combat mystical oh, threats. I don't know what I would Learn use. long forgotten mysteries. Become the witch or wizard you want to be as you leave your unique mark on the wizarding world. Here in Hogwarts Legacy. I would want to be the best of the best um, wizard, not the, the uh, like Lord of all. Anymore. That was your first extended look at Hogwarts Legacy. Now let's hear from the real wizards and witches behind the okay. game. Okay. I'll add this into it. Yeah. Let's see what these have to say as well. The attention to detail and the passion and the love for this brand that the team has is astonishing. Yeah. I agree with that. Our team is so excited to take all of the love that they put into this as fans and give it to fans. This is the game that they've dreamed of for 20 years. Yeah. The lore of the Wizarding World is already so rich, and all we had to do was harness those elements and build a game out of it. The movies, the books, they all touched me in such a way. Like, it makes me want to go to experience Hogwarts. It makes me put in <laughs> so much more detail into this game. You've done freaking amazing, these people that created this. We really want to make sure that anything we add or anything we play with or anything that we explore really feels authentic. Bringing to life just the charm and the love, everything we have for the books, and then marrying that with the iconic experiences from the movies that fans will recognize yeah. is really just the perfect handshake between the two. I love it. I love the artwork. This. Just the discovery of like seeing things portrayed for the first time. Maybe they've read something and had a picture in their head the whole time, just, but then finally to get to touch it, to walk around it. Nice that they've combined got it all both these the elements that can come together to films. create this amazing AAA open world action RPG. When it comes to the open world, it's just we just knew it wasn't going to be enough to just stare out of the windows of Hogwarts and wonder what it's like out there. But the final question that fans ask is, what's beyond that? What's beyond the Forbidden Forest? What's going to be beyond Hogsmeade? What's beyond the Black Lake if I start traveling south? And we just felt like we had to answer those questions. I'm getting this when it's up. We were creating a real wide palette of opportunities and ways to explore the world you're gonna see different stories that are really exclusive to who you were in the world. Hogwarts Legacy is an original story that takes place in the late 1800s. You are a new student who is starting at the famed School of Witchcraft and Wizardry as a fifth year, which is very unusual. So already there's a bit of an edge yeah. and a bit of a mystery. The original story that we tell in the game is your story of what you did you know, in the wizarding world that you haven't seen before. Or make our own magic with our story we're trying to tell. Fans are familiar with the wizarding world from, you know, the 1900s and on, really. But now, with this world, we're able to sort of create a space that's their own. Which is cool. I like that feature. Fans of the series will know that ancient magic has been around for a long time, to say the least, and that Hogwarts itself is a stronghold of ancient magic. And the avatar, the player, has the ability to sense it and possibly wield it or control it. Our process of development started with rereading the books. And over development, we reread the books many times. Every time we'd start with a new feature, we'd dig into that. And then beyond, we would go into the films. It's like they've put everything on the films, everything, the books. Being able to combine put it into one thing. Spin on what this universe is was a pretty big deal. I helped design a piece that nobody has ever seen before, the Hufflepuff Common Room. 
you know, as a Hufflepuff, you always wondered, like, what, what is my common room supposed to look like? It's close enough to the world that we know that fans will recognize certain names, they'll recognize spells, they'll recognize certain locations. I recognize that doorway, I recognize that classroom. But mostly, it's gonna be an entirely new wizarding world that no one's ever experienced. As well, which is cool. When people engage in the wizarding world, what's the one anchor? Like, what's the thing that everyone comes back to? What's the thing that grounds it all and grounds all these characters and grounds all these Hogwarts. figures? And for us, we really felt like that answer was Hogwarts yeah. itself. That school, that famous school of witchcraft and wizardry, is really what binds it all. How to bring Hogwarts to life, that was a very big challenge because as everybody knows, Hogwarts is huge. Now we need to know exactly how this passage connects to this passage for a game because you're gonna have to walk it. And of course, again, the Sentient Castle, it's, it's got new surprises up its sleeves. It likes to keep its students on its toes. <laughs> we put so many little secrets and passageways and rooms in this castle. We recreate those very important locations. And then there's these other places that are only mentioned in the books or just alluded to. And we have to make the connective tissue that brings all that together. It is incredible. I think a site. world that the fact is that you a can do that, breathing, the fact that they've got the world fantastic world beast type of things in it. Hard to do because it's all about the details. And as a concept team, we really got into those details and studied history, studied architecture. Details makes a game. I hope that when fans play details. the game, they get as lost in it as I do. I can just be reviewing a side mission, and all of a sudden I find myself wandering Hogwarts for like 45 minutes because <laughs> it's so beautiful. That's cool. The community is absolutely going to love Hogwarts Legacy. Yeah. It's going to be so fun. Get that letter to Hogwarts and go to Hogwarts. We're so excited for people to come to this, to inhabit it, to actually enter the Hogwarts that we built. This is your Hogwarts Legacy. I hope as well that you can do We truly hope you enjoyed the Hogwarts Legacy State of Play. Our team is so grateful for the excitement and for the passion that all of you bring to this. It's truly what fuels us. I'm getting it. On behalf Don't of our team <laughs> at WB Games Avalanche, we want to thank you for being here today and we'll see you at Hogwarts. Yeah, you will. That's our show. We hope you're excited for the magic to come. See you next time. So yeah guys, I am definitely getting that. Uh, I like the fact that they've combined the books, both versions of the films, so you've got the Harry Potter films, as well as the Fantastic Beasts. They've combined both stuff, all three things together. Uh, the fact that you've got a, a room where you can customise your own little things, bring little um, creatures back to your place. Uh... You can chant different spells, you can create spells, you can have different costumes on and you've got your own path, you can create your own path through it. It's like you can either go to the evil side like what Lord Voldemort did or be like uh, Albus Dumbledore. That powerful, those two iconic characters. Now me, I am not going to do the Lord Voldemort side of it. I'm going to do the best of the wizard you can possibly be. And I was trying to say in this as well, I bet there will be an online type of thing as well with it, where different commun different people that are playing it, um, you're able to see them playing the game with you. That would be amazing. Because it's you against everyone else then. And or teaming up with people in your Gryffindor, Slytherin, Hufflepuff or Ravenclaw um, groups. Yeah, I, I'm loving this. I want this. Um, when I first seen that they were doing another Harry Potter game, but with its own new story, but keeping the same fundamental um, game, that's what made me like, yeah. <laughs> so if you've really enjoyed this episode guys um, this reaction smash the hell out of that like button and please do a huge favor and subscribe um, and I noticed a few people like out of the the non and sub it's more non over sub that are watching my channel so I'm like 
I would like it like this or like this. <laughs> so guys, it does not cost you anything. It helps me out if you subscribe to me and just watch the video that way. If you just watch the video without subscribing, all it does is just allows you to watch it obviously. But it don't help me out because you've watched it. It just adds like a like or a view. So it helps me out and gets me to doing other things for you guys. And yeah. So I will leave this in the description if you want to watch it. You can. Uh, so yeah. So like, subscribe, share, comment below what you thought of today's episode. And catch me in that next video. Peace out guys. Stay safe, keep safe, always look after your friends and family, and take care. Bye-bye, guys. What you gonna do now?